What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. My name is Joe or QS Airsoft and welcome back to the Go and Fly YouTube channel. Today's video we're going to be talking about the new Fly ABC Bandolier Chest Rig. Now this chest rig has been in development for quite a long time and I'm very excited to bring this video for you guys. As of right now we only have multicam but I'm pretty sure we're going to get some other camo options in the future. Now this chest rig is really neat. I like how you can customize this thing to however you want it. Uh, you can buy different panels for this as you can see right here. I have a second panel which is super cool. You can have two different loadouts on just one chest rig. So I can swap out this chest rig panel and then put on this one right here. First we're going to talk about this main setup that I have right here which is the one that I would run if this was my chest rig. So on the front right here we do have a ABC pouch bundle is what we're calling it. It basically comes with the triple M4 mag pouch, the two pistol mag pouch, and then this admin pouch right here, which I think is really, really cool. I play a lot of CQB, so this is the chest rig that I would personally run because I only go through maybe two or three mags anyway, so I would always keep three in my chest rig and then one in my gun, so I'd have four mags total. And then if I'm ever running a pistol, I have two pistol mag pouches right here, which is plenty. And I can always use the admin pouch right here to keep more mag pouch, more, um, pistol mags or speed loaders if I wanted to. And if we get a little bit closer here, I'll show you guys on the GoPro. They got the triple mag pouch up here, which they do have retention straps. Go. So yeah, it does have the retention straps, so if you're afraid of your mags falling out, you won't have to worry about that. Um, the ma uh, pistol mag pouches are really nice. They fit, these are, these are Glock style mag pouches, so I, or mags, sorry, Glock, these are Glock mags, so I don't think you'll have any problems using high cap of mags in there or any other stuff like that. You could also fit multi tools in these pouches or whatever you want to put inside. Um, inside this pouch, I don't have anything in here right now except for the tags that came with these uh, because this is not my chest rig so I have to return these. I'm just doing this for the video. So yeah, they have a decently sized uh, admin pouch up here. You can definitely fit a speed loader in there, um, your phone or whatever stuff you want to put in there. Also included in the base panel itself is a small little pouch at the top here as you can see so you can put stuff in there if you really wanted to your phone so I can show you guys really quick boom put my phone in there fits nice and then it also comes with this super cool carry handle or drag handle whatever you want to call it um, on all the panels or all the chest rigs they all come with one of these which is super helpful and then on each side here we have these two flaps, which I believe are separate from the actual chest rig. Uh, if we come over here to the side panel right here, I have a radio pouch. Now inside the radio pouch, I of course have a radio. I have a Baofeng UV5R. Fits nice in there. And this pouch can probably fit a lot of bigger radios out there. I don't know what's bigger than a UV5R. Probably those old Motorola ones. And then coming down to the straps, so these straps are made of, I want to say 500D, so they're pretty pretty strong, they're pretty thick as well, they're definitely not going to rip or tear on you or anything. You can easily detach the straps by pushing these buttons right here, I will demonstrate. Push the button, it's kind of hard. There we go, comes right out, that's one way you can take it off or you can just throw it on. Also on the sides here, we have the side one there and then the one over there. And then this is the one on the sides of the carrier. These are the ones that go around your back and connect behind you. Uh, so I'll just throw it on for you guys really quick just to give you guys an idea of what it looks like. So the straps aren't adjusted super perfectly, but as you can see, sorry, this might sound terrible for the mic, but as you can see, it looks pretty nice. It's a little low, like I said, straps aren't adjusted. Um, it's a chest chest rig not a belly rig um, but yeah as you can see I've got all the pouches up here it works pretty nice but yeah super cool uh, I'm a big fan of this chest rig I'm gonna show you guys how you can switch out the panels so taking a look at these uh, the sides right here you have these little buttons so originally they would be buttoned in here to be more secure but all you do is simply Peel it off, and then I should probably put some mags in here. All right, got some mags inside. Um, so this panel is just a triple M4 mag pouch. You can fit 
two mags in each of these pouches. And then here we have a mini dangler, which is new. Uh, we have these in all colors, all camos, so go check those out. Link in the description. So, we're going to, let me fix this a little bit because it makes it a little difficult. All right, and now we just line up the buttons. So there we go. Other panel is now attached with the mini dangler on it. Uh, so this is a more minimal style, still having the radio on the side. I'll throw it on for you guys really quick. There we have it. Mini dangler, boom. Oh, there we go. Mini dangler can fit some stuff in there. We got the radio pouch on here. Get your radio. Then the three triple mag pouch up here. A little, little admin pouch up there too. Super cool, super minimal. So, I think that's it for this video, you guys. Before we go, I wanted to let you guys know that this chest rig was inspired by UW Gear. Their bandolier really inspired us to make this chest rig. So I will leave a link to that in the description if you guys want to check that out to see where we got the inspiration for this chest rig. I will also leave links to everything you see in the video, all of the patches or pouches, all of the panels, everything like that, and even the rig itself. Super affordable, super minimal. I highly recommend this for anyone who is shooting real steel. I think it would be really cool to take this to the range, uh, swap out your kits or whatever. It's a lot like other chest rigs on the market, but at a very affordable price. Thank you guys all for watching this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.